Hey guys, welcome to our garden here at the farmhouse. I um, want to invite you guys in and share a little bit about it. Uh, we built this space three years ago now, I think, and we put in raised beds for all of our veggies and flowers. We have a lot of raspberries in the back, grapes all around the edge. This is going to be just green and vibrant here in a little bit. We have fruit trees. Uh, we put a patio in with furniture. So this is where we hang out all summer. We eat most of our meals out here. And we are just getting up our string lights for the year. Garrett devised a very cool way to hang those. He took a metal rod and he built it, bent it into a shepherd's hook. And it's a relatively easy DIY. It's super cute, a great way to hang things like string lights. So he's gonna share that with you right now. This is in partnership with burns o -Matic. We're using a TS-8000, which is a really powerful torch. And with the MAP gas, it even, gets even hotter than propane. So it's gonna be perfect for this project. First thing we're gonna do is check our fuel cylinder with the gas gauge to see, make sure we have enough fuel for the project. Secure the rod to a sturdy work surface and then heat the rod at about 10 inches from the end. Once the rod is getting red, use your channel locks to start the bend. Continue heating the rod around the bend as you complete your curve. Once you're happy with your first curve, it's time to work on the little crook at the end that will actually hold your string lights. And then use a hacksaw to cut the rod to length for your project. And then you're gonna drill down about eight inches into the top of your post. You're gonna set your rod in there Hang up your string lights and voila, instant ambiance. 